Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. Hey Titans, it's Patrick here and welcome to Titan TV. To start us off this week is Daily Update. Hey Titans, I'm Kaylin. And I'm Delaney and this is your Daily Update. Starting next week, every Wednesday at lunch, your counselors will be opening up a college application and FAFSA Zoom Help Desk Center. These applications were open yesterday. Temesco Canyon Spirit Packs are on sale now. The pack contained a tie-in strong shirt, mask, and a hand sanitizer for $20. This spirit pack can be purchased online from the TCHS website. Freshmen, has distance learning been a bit stressful? Do you struggle with a particular subject and not know where to get extra help? Starting October 1st, the NHS Club will be hosting Titan Tutoring. Sessions on via Zoom on Tuesday and Thursday from 3.30 to 4.30 p.m. Stop by and get some help from an NHS member for any subject you need help in. Please sign up and use a link on the screen. Now welcome our new segment for the month of October. Hey y'all, it's me Kylie and I'm so excited to announce it's officially spooky season. Bats, cobwebs, spiders, pumpkins, witches, skeletons, candy. And with spooky season comes scary stories with Kylie. You heard it here folks, scary stories with Kylie is officially back in business. So this spooky season we will be reading two sentence scary stories. Let's get right into them. Story number one. I found a picture on my phone of me sleeping, but I live alone. Ooh, spooky. Story number two. It's safe to come out now, sweetie. Dad said reassuring, his blue eyes shining at me through the gap in the bedroom door. He has been saying that for hours and it doesn't change the fact that my dad's eyes are green. And that's it. And once again, I'm Kylie, and this has been Scary Stories with Kylie, and I'll see you guys on Tuesday. Bye! Let's make the most of the night like we're gonna die! Hey, hey Titans, I'm Summer, and this is Shopping with Summer, Halloween Costume Edition. These ideas are for a group of friends, so if you have friends, then this, this is for you. So the first person, you're gonna need a button down shirt, it, preferably red, some khakis, boom, you're Jake from State Farm. The next, the next person, you need a white colored shirt, a white apron, congratulations, you are now Flo. And then if you're wondering how to dress up as a Geico lizard, just reuse your white apron from Flo, put it over green pants and a green shirt, and boom, you're a lizard. Ge gecko. It's not a lizard, it's a gecko. <laughs> then we're gonna need a white shirt and then some yellow leggings. <laughs> Preferably a bill. Congratulations, you're now the Aflac duck. <laughs> that was your shopping with Summer. I hope it was helpful. If anyone does this, please send it to me. Once again, I'm Kaylin. And I'm Delaney, and this is your daily update. Now enjoy the rest of your Friday episode. See you next week, Titans. Thank you to Kaylin and Delaney and the rest of our Daily Update crew. And now we're going up to Ask Amy with a new topic. 
Hello everybody and welcome to another segment of Ask Amy. Ask Amy is a segment where I, Amy, answer the questions that y'all have about life, school, just stuff in general. But today it's about school. I asked you guys on my Instagram and on the Titan TV's Instagram to ask me questions about school and you guys did. So I'm gonna answer them now. So we don't have to be confused no more. We can be focused, I don't know. We can just have the answers. I don't know. I'm here to deliver. How do I interact more in my Zooms? Okay, I'm gonna give you two answers for that one because I can give you two answers for that one. Um, number one, try to answer more questions in class or ask more questions, vice versa. Even if you don't know it, like the teachers will appreciate the effort. And number two, I don't know. Before class, like when that silence moment, like it, I don't know if your teacher does this, like they wait until like the rest of the students come in. I don't know, try and start a conversation. I know in some classes, like my my leadership class, we do that sometimes. Like so it will be dead silent while we're waiting for everyone to come in, and I'll just be like, "So how y'all doing?" And then that starts a conversation. So next question: How do I stay focused in class? That's pretty hard. You really asked a real unfocused person. Like I'm never, I'm exposing myself right there. I don't care. Anyway, I'm unfocused in class. So the way I focus in class is I don't sit at my computer when I'm like listening to a lesson. If I'm like trying to focus, I sit on somewhere comfy or uncomfortable. Like I either sit on the floor or lay on the floor or like sit on my couch next to my computer and then just listen to the lesson like that unless I have to take notes because I don't like sitting at the desk computer all the time, especially because I have bad eyes. So if you want to sit at the computer, be my guest. But if you can't focus, do something while you're listening. Like just keep yourself like occupied at the same time. How's your coloring book going? Okay, this is funny. My teacher recommended that I get a coloring book to like deal with stress and stuff like that. And I suggest that you do too, because that really does help with stress especially with the online school thing because we're on our phones all the time and on the computer all the time. So, you know, when we came home from school, our escape was our phone, but now it's the coloring book. I, her words, not mine. Anyways, um, so get a coloring book and the coloring book is fine. Okay guys, that's the end of our questions. Thank you guys for sending in all those nice questions and continue to send them in and continue to like check out the Titan TV's Instagram and check out my Instagram. And we're working on the Google Doc so everyone can be a part of it. And yeah, I think we're done. Big thank you to Amy and all those who submitted questions. And now we're gonna take a glimpse into the day in the life of Sawyer and Joseph, our Titan TV baseball members. What's up guys, I'm Joseph Dahlia with the Temesco Canyon baseball team, and this is my day in the life. I'm Sawyer, and I'm a senior on the baseball team, and today I'm going to be showing you what a day in my life of practice is like. What's up guys, just got to campus, about to head down to the field and get this work in. I'm with my friend Josh now, we're going to practice, this is the field, and we're about to get started before we do some stretches and then we're gonna run a little bit. So stay tuned for that. Just got to the field, got the man, post, and Valley. And Valley, what up?
practice with Coach Post. I hope you all enjoyed a day in the life of a baseball player with me, Sawyer. That's it for my day in the life. See you, Titans.